Welcome to this edition of Video Drone by DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, we're going to take a look at disassembling the uh, Hubson controller. So, one of the pieces I want to do is I want to do some mods on this, but you got to take it apart first. So, I haven't really seen anybody take this apart, so I'm going to do a little bit of an instructional video on disassembly. So, to take the, the controller apart, what you have to do is there's three screws in the back, two up here on each corner, and then one inside the battery compartment. Now, what happens is there are latches here at the bottom of the handle. So you'll have to take a regular screwdriver and very carefully work around the corners to pop this up because what happens is this locks onto these two at the bottom. So when you go to place it back on, it'll tip back in like this, and then the screws hold it from the top and center. So you need to be careful. These are the only other two clips. So they will pop off, but you just need to be careful and work your way around. Removal of the board itself is in there by four screws, so far less than in the SEMA controller. So you have a screw here, 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 and here. You take that out and the whole unit pops out. Now, one of the mods that I want to do is an antenna mod, so uh, there seems to be a fair amount of room in the top of this to get a um, uh, antenna. So it looks like they got a locator pin um, here and here. For the case to go together so what we'll have to do is, is uh, take like a hot knife and cut that out and then we'll probably just drill a hole for the connector uh, I'll play around with a couple ideas and I'll do a bit of a video once I do that mod part but I kind of want to show you how what's in here and how it kind of goes together because this is the antenna itself and the antenna actually sits crossways in this bumped out opening and you notice, I give them at least credit, it's got a little bit of a choke to it, so uh, it's probably more than a little bit of a dipole, but I'm not sure what's inside of the shrink wrap tubing, but it feels like a coil. And then it's got a micro cap connector, I'm not sure if I'll be able to get this in, underneath the LCD screen. Now, this is where it gets a little wanky, because the transmitter is under the LCD screen, and the LCD screen is soldered into the board, so getting this off will be you know not something you know for the faint of heart however I think I can take a small screwdriver pop this micro cap off and if I get another uh, micro cap connector type antenna I think I'll be able to attach it and I'll be good so I'm gonna order one off of Amazon and see how it comes in and see if I can do that if I can I think I'll be golden so anyways hopefully you found this interesting you get to see what's inside the Hubson's controller and if you did hey give it a thumbs up uh, greatly appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. A lot more of this coming. If you have any questions or comments, hit me up below, and we'll see you in the next video. Cheers.